President Biden today spoke with the families of U.S. troops killed in a drone attack in Jordan over the weekend. Also today, the president said that he has decided how the U.S. will respond to the attack. Fox's Rebecca Castor has more. It's hard for the parents to endure. Um, that's why I honor her so much and believe she's a hero. American families now grieving after a drone struck a U.S. base in Jordan over the weekend, killing three U.S. soldiers. The White House blames an Iran-backed group for the deadly strike, sparking calls for retaliation. The only way to solve that threat is to directly target Iran's terrorist forces throughout the region and in Iran itself. President Biden says he's made a decision on how to respond. A senior U.S. official telling Fox it will likely come in phases. I don't think we need a wider war in the Middle East. That's not what I'm looking for. This is one of those rare situations that I don't know that an immediate retaliatory strike is exactly what's needed. We're not here to play a tit-for-tat game with Iran on their terms. Yet, Iran proxies continue to target military bases in the region and disrupt shipping in the Red Sea. While we do not seek to escalate tensions in the region, we will also take all necessary actions to protect our troops, our facilities, and our interests. On Tuesday, President Biden spoke with the families of those killed in the drone strike and will be in Dover, Delaware on Friday for the dignified transfer of their remains. In Washington, Rebecca Castor, Fox 4 News.